You can't just stab people. Take care of your problem. Life lessons from a cheetah. Welcome back to that handsome face. Ah, it's me, Kermit. At this point, we've gone through all the basic characters. Like, I've done a playthrough of everybody. So I thought, let's do a challenge. And before, you know, so I don't have to decide what to do, I'm going to look at the daily challenge and see if it's, you know, something interesting. Sure, Electromancer Boss Rush. Play as the Electromancer Ichita. Sure. Why not? Then I don't have to pick, like, hmm, which of the modifiers should I show off today? Uh, how does she play? I think she's like a kind of like Greybeard, but lightning based. I don't remember. Sure, execute. That's a fun thing. Trap, no. Trap, no. So I guess that. Choose wisely. Chill, that's always, you know, vampire. I like vampire. So it's a boss rush, which means we only have five levels and they're all the boss levels. Surprise. Who would have guessed that a boss rush would be fighting all the bosses? Yes, so yeah, you skip yes. all the middle runs, and it's just that, like, each level, as you saw me pick at the beginning, it's like you get to pick two cards, you get to get two perks, um, and then you just skip all the in-between levels. It, it is harder, but, you know, they, they give you stuff for it. Uh, so what's my ability? The Arcanist. Okay, so she has Greybeard's Arcanist ability, so that, like, when you, uh, you know, get a card, it will damage the person in the top row. Um, but then she's sort of got a fighting style, I guess, a little similar to Mischief. Like, she doesn't have Mischief's, like, stealth and one damage versus three, you know, all that business. But, because look, it's like, you know, Vagabond boots and, you know, you're getting a leather helm for armor stuff. And here you thought a boss rush was a foot race with a bunch of bosses. I mean, it is. It's, this is just the, the interpretation of a foot race in this game. What a fight! Uh, Mighty hero of the yeah, sure. Well, he's at the top row, so let's burn him. That'll do damage as he falls, but... I guess that... This is weird. Ow. And that hurts. I mean, this boss rush might be done on this first one, and then I do have to pick a thing. Uh, sure, I have a helmet. I guess there's no point using my weapon, because I get hit either way. Uh, yeah. I know he said fortuitous, because that's what he says, but it sounds like he says gratuitous. The amount of violence I'm dealing on them? Why, yes, it is gratuitous. How kind of you to notice. Uh, sure, execute. I can't do it on a boss, so... That guy. This is a... This is a thing. Hmm. Okay. Beat up this little guy. The problem is all these guys are gonna... And that guy are gonna give me stupid when I beat them, which means more health. Well, okay, so the first thing is stupid won't matter because we don't have any more abilities to buy. So it's like, oh no, it costs more to buy abilities that we don't have, who cares? But then I'm gonna get more copies. I'll have to make room for them. There is our problem. Okay, I can do this, I can do this. Um, let me math this out. I know math. What the heck? So I hit him for two. He hits me for four. Then I put on the boots. Stunned. He can't. Yeah, 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 yeah. Oh, no. I'm stupid. Oh, abilities cost more. What'll I do? Ow. I got hurt. That's what I'll do. Okay. Nice. Tranquilizer. Splat it. All right, let's put him to sleep the first round. We'll take the four so that he does three to himself. And then, yeah, he's frozen, so his, like, blitz five attack? We don't care. That takes him out. 
which leaves this guy. Okay, yeah, 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 that's right. Make him go to sleep the first round so he doesn't do four. Make him go to sleep the second round so he doesn't do four. And then it's like, oh no, he hits us for two. He's frozen for his four attack. And we hit him. But who was, were you worried? I wasn't worried. I was very worried. You have questions about the tail that just keeps wiggling frantically even when she's not moving much? That's ah, fine. Yeah, see, I thought she had stuff like mischief. Yeah, hidden blades. We loved it. And we love. Ooh, wait, 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 wait. I want both of these. Lightning Strike is good for multi hit, but which is Broom? Because then we could shuffle two copies of Hidden Blade, which would give us another. You know, we've been over this with Mischief. The Hidden Blade makes two stabs, each stab makes two, you know. So it gets real. It gets a lot of stabs. I think we do Witch's Broom. I think we get our reshuffle enemies. Choose wisely. And ba 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 Hornet, sure. When you attack with a weapon, you do poison, you do extra damage to poison things. What I'm hoping is we'll get the thing that starts with people poison. Judicator, yeah. Plus one damage when you take a lot. We're taking a lot of damage. And... Ooh. Nor might be like minor, that's a good default one, you know, two extra health and you get a hundred gems so you can buy more stuff. But starting with short sword, chain mail, and matches, especially the short sword, we'll, we'll try that. I probably should have picked minor, but buy another in blades. Um, and we'll take that. Okay, that's good for me. Yeah, it's like, we just got a thing that poisons people when you hit them with a weapon. It's like, starting with a weapon seems like a good idea. I don't know. So studious. So studious. You're on fire. I guess I could have taken... Yeah, it's like, oh, well, too bad if I'd taken whatever the one the fire spell was it's like do four damage or an additional six for a total of ten if they're on fire if i knew i was starting with matches but them's the break it's fine uh now nah, leave sell the lightning trap i don't want it but it gives us free coin okay we have another thing of hidden blades so i'll buy that and use it and then when we get the witch's broom we'll just copy this one you crush them. Oh, yeah, I don't need to use it on mm. the Because thing it's like, oh yeah, like do that, and then they'll get one less attack, but I forgot about freeze. It doesn't matter because they don't have blitz, so they only get one attack on me anyway. Oh well. I haven't played this game in a long time. I'm stupid. We all know this. But yeah, it's, it's it's just a little. I mean, it's probably a magical raccoon tail. So it's just you know got a life of its own. Like, come on, this is totally a game where you make mag magical raccoon tail, wiggle it at enemies to disorient them or something. Uh, boots. Yeah, 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 yeah. Parry time. Well parried. Oh, you don't even get to use your blood magic to finish you off. All right, this works. Uh, I need to use some of this stuff, but we'll buy this. He'll take a damage from falling. Then we can buy Execute and just kill him straight out. And then we don't have to worry about his, like, eight damage attack. Uh, sure, you. And you. Uh... Yeah, okay, that works out. With the attack, it lowers it by one extra because of the poison, so we can kill him on this turn before he hits us. It's all good. It works. All right. Buy this. They took damage because of the thing. Oh. I don't have space, so let's use this.
now that I have space. Like, oh no, a guy with eight damage. Dead. Oh, now there's another one. Boo. Boo. Fine. You. And... Sure, let's kill these guys. I was like, why do I still have so much health? Right, I have Vampire. Oh, and I have Judicator, so now I'm doing even... Ah. Everything's coming up at Cheetah. And you... And... Uh. Huh. There's more bad guys, see? Well, okay. Let's do that. Whoop, get in the deck. Here we go. That's what I wanted. And then we go. More of those. And a little more of those. And then we start just getting so many cards to get gems. There's so many. It's wonderful. Ow. And then each one makes two, and we stab you a bunch. Nah, yeah, I do need some heavy hitting attacks, though. I'm seeing that now. Like, I can't just rely on stab to take care of all my pro- You can't just stab people to take care of your problems. Life lessons from a cheetah. How much do I do on a hit right now? Three, yeah. Not what I wanted. This. Then that. Then I do that. Uh, I think I just take the hit. It's gonna hurt. Wait, will this work? Okay, three damage. To him. He does three, so that's six. Then I do three is nine. He does another three is 12. And then he, I kill him before he attacks, yeah. It, it's painful, but it's fine. And then this, we just parry so we get some more health back from Vampire. Uh, let's attack you with this so that we get more health from Vampire. Now nah, I'll take two damage, but that'll heal up on its own, so that one is a wash. More cards. More cards. All right, what else do we get in our little... Hey, look at that. More cards. All the gems. Interesting to know that the book... I should have kept one on the board so I could use Seek. But yeah, the, the tome doesn't just give you random magic spells. It gives you spells specific to what you already have. So like you get hidden blades when you use it as a cheetah. That's nice. I think I want this because... Two arms. Like I can hit... Yeah. And it's like, oh no, I'm damaged. And it's like, oh no, he'll kill me. Just cycle him out. Bye. I didn't know there was a you left. Uh, let's just keep stabbing him. And stab. Well, I might not end up with a lot of cards left then. Because I'm going to use them all fighting the Ghost King. Fortuitous. Oh, and I'm bro. Boo. Strategize. Uh, my strategy is please don't hurt me so much. 
Oh no! I agree, crewman. I agree. <laughs> it's a sound strategy if a bit underdeveloped. I mean, it's kind of the only strategy I've got. Like, I don't have anything hard hitting. Like, my, my strategy is try and do enough damage before he kills me. We'll see how well this works. I don't know that it's going to. I only have five health. Yeah, if he wasn't healing, it would have been fine. But he was healing, so I lose by one turn. Oh no, I lost. Okay, well, what other things can we do? That's a mutation. I mean, I can do an Electromancer run that's not a boss rush. <laughs> I didn't lose, I learned the weak points of my strategy so I can improve it. I. That's very kind of you to say, except I've had this game for years. I already know what I'm doing. I just didn't do it well. But I can pretend. Uh, also, how are you doing, Weird Judge? It's been a while. Uh, I mean, sure, let's try another Electrum. In fact, let's just try the same thing again. Choose a hero. <laughs> Choose a hero. Choose between this one or not this one. How shocking. Choose between this one or playing a different modifier. What will be revealed? Okay, so maybe this time we'll take Incinerate. Granted, when I was choosing between Incinerate or the the bell, the recycle stuff in, I didn't have um, Adventurer perk at the time, so like, I didn't know. Choose wisely. Minor. Okay, yeah, I think Judicator's still a good call. Prepare for the road ahead. Hidden blades and. Let's, let's eviscerate isn't bad especially with hidden blades because it's it's do a lot before piercing damage and then you have to use four abilities to recharge it that's not bad but i think i'll take the tome of element i like that it's also the tome of elemental magic apparently like shanking someone with a knife is elemental magic Abracadabra stab. I'm not sure I've heard of that spell before, but sure. Okay, so we'll keep this. Pair it with Char when uh, Bramble shows up. <laughs> Elementally sneaking past the It's true. Not from her. I don't have chill this time. Or vampire, for that matter. We can buy that now. Because there's Bramble. The war bears bow to Bramble. Hit him really hard. Uh, Actually, execute wouldn't be bad for some of the barbarians. Okay, four again. Yeah, we'll... That one at least gives us a few copies rather than like, you can either pick Zap or pick a thing that gives you Zap and another, you know, we'll, we'll take that because we can sell it to heal since we don't have Vampire. Splatter. Yeah, it works out well for the Barbarians with Execute because they don't even attack the first round. So this is like hit them, die, hit them, they die. Now we get to well these 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 ladies aren't too bad. We can fight them. Ow. And we get some healing so that we don't die. Now I should actually strategize. I know, weird. In a game about strategy, I should use some. I don't know what you're talking about. Well, by that, because we have Arcanist, 
We'll get that to spawn on top so that then we, when we buy this, it'll do damage to Bram. And we'll you know, send it back in. Kill him because he's got... Because, uh, like, yeah, we could use three damage to any of these people, but that guy's got... What's that? Blitz. I don't know why I couldn't think of the word. So buy a dagger, and then again, stab comes in on this level, damage Bramble. Stab him. Damage Bramble. Uh, stab him once. Hit, hit. Now he's gone. All right. And then these folks, the, uh... Are you even... Peasant. You peasant. They only do three damage total. Because, you know, they hit for one, and then they hit for two, and then I beat them on the next turn. So I can survive that, so I don't need to use any more cards. Uh, what I should do, though, is do that. Oh, it didn't... Because, right, route of cards. Like, I should use it, because then it will cycle. That'll give us an extra card. No, it won't, because we're out of the deck, so it disappears. It doesn't cycle. I mean, we didn't lose anything. Because we're not going to keep our gold, so... We transformed one card into another, and neither of them helped us. But that's okay. I want more hidden blades. Like, I always want hidden blades, but... I'll take lightning strike. That doomed us last time. So this time we'll... Yeah, wishing land. And... Uh, sure, Brewer. Because then at least we get two health potions. Because, like, Savage, add a copy of Frenzy. We don't need Frenzy as a cheetah. Your damage is increased by one against solitary enemies, but your deck size is decreased by one. That's okay. Like, we're not using our full deck right now anyways. But I feel like... I mean, like, but the thing is, because we don't gain any other... Like, it's not like... You know, if you're playing as a mischief, like, you're already trying to get people solitary, so, like, having more damage on them wouldn't be bad. But with Ichida, we're not necessarily trying to get people solitary, and we're trying to, you know, get things spawning in to do damage with Arcanus. So I think rather than trying to get people positioned, like, perfectly, we'll just do that. Forrester, yes. Well, both of these are good. Forrester, because especially you saw this with the Mischief from like, Forrester being able to copy things that make more things gets crazy power. But we're not using weapons as a cheetah. So, like, items cost one less. Like, I mean, okay, yeah, we'll sometimes, like, stab a person with a knife, but we're only using one weapon at a time, which means that, for instance, our, like, book of spells cost less. Both of these are good. I wish, because, like, you get two, you know, perks because we're doing boss rush. It'd be nice if you could pick both of those. But I can't. Max health by six or heal when you're below 50%. Both good. We'll go survivor. Welcome, welcome. Wishing lamps, welcome. always good for any character. Lots of damage. Lots of random. Let's go. <laughs> you're trying to figure out how a cheetah would use a weapon, like Sif style, or stuck to the end of their tail. I think, I think it, a, well, I think a cheetah... Well, now I'm thinking because you specifically you said Sif, so I'm thinking Dark Souls. I think a cheetah would have it in their tail, specifically because then they could run up really fast, bite you, and then, like, when they're holding on with their bite, then, like, whip their tail around and hit. Like, I think that's how a, a cheetah Dark Souls boss would be. So I think that's how it'd have to go. Will you now, isn't this a fun fight? I do two damage each round. She does two damage each round. Together, we're boring. Let's do it again. It was so interesting the first time. Alright, now what we want? Tome of Elemental... Uh, money. Tome of Elemental Magic. And money. Because we can do this, like Perhaps hidden blades. Gosh, shouldn't have gone. It's fine. Uh, let's take an execute. By this. And we got two because of that. And now, because we have Forester, whatever tile we get rid of next, we get more of. 
So let's get something, replace the tome, and then we get even more. So it basically turns your tome into getting free spells off the bat. And then it copies it. and It's just so wonderful. And then you get two copies for free. So when that comes around again, each of those has three. And we use the wishing lamp to get even more. It's amazing. Uh, also because we got a thing of execute. He's dead. Mm. I'm gonna see what we get in the pirate lockbox. Yeah, money is probably our best bet there. These guys, I need like one other thing of armor. Because if you can block the first hit, like if you can block two damage, they're not really an issue. Because like block it, and then they're parried for their four. Block it, they're parried for their eight. But without blocking, they gonna wreck me. Hmm. What a fine. So we'll do that to kill him. Pull all tiles back in the deck. Let's get our Tome of Elemental Magic first. That will be oh, hi. Look, it's me, Chief Electromancer Ichita. Magic's just technology I don't understand yet, but I will... I will understand all. Man, lady, you make me sound crazy. Okay, maybe I am a little crazy, but... There, reset everyone. What do we got? I don't know, like, you see, here's a... I'm just pausing and I'm thinking and you're like, please start being a streamer again. Stop staring at your screen. Okay. Let me explain my thought process. So lightning strike, 12 damage dealt between people evenly. <laughs> you want to call yourself an electromancer when you're doing tech support? I do it. That's amazing. But you can even put that on a business card and be like, like, oh yeah, Minotaur, electromancer and hand it out to people. You'd make an impression. And like, sure, some people would be like, eh, how boring. But like, anyone whose opinion matters would be like, that's awesome. Okay, oh uh, yeah, anyways, 12 piercing damage. I can do this two different ways. I think, because like, if I buy this, they all fall and I can buy this and then hit all four, you know, these three plus this guy for that. And all of them would take three damage. That would be good for especially the two super robots and him. But if I buy it here, like without without causing him to fall, he'll drop in here and I can use it. Those three will take four damage, but will kill this guy outright. And that might be the better call. Uh, I think that's going to be the better call. And then we just hope we get some damage. Stuff. Yeah, okay. That'll take care of him. Yeah, do that. All right, draft. Ooh. Oh, those are all good. So I use seek, uh, which I clicked on really fast in case you weren't reading it and don't want to like, you know, freeze frame the VOD or whatever. Uh, it lets you copy something that costs four or less that's on the board currently. And I got a jack, but like Tome of Elemental Magic would be amazing. Lightning Storm would be amazing, and Hidden Blades would be amazing. Like, no, ma sometimes when you do this, it's like, oh, it picked three of the bad things, like the one thing you wanted, it didn't pick. I can't go wrong with any of these. Now, I'll probably skip Hidden Blades. Like, yes, adding more stabs is fun. Getting more, co like, coins and gems at the end is fun. But, like, if you're spending, like, if you're getting something up to four for free, you might as well make it one of the more pricey things. Like, do I want instant damage guaranteed to everyone? Or do we want three things of spells that, like, could produce a lot of stuff, but won't necessarily? Let's do some instant. I want instant gratification. Bam! Look at that. You're all injured. How do you like them apples? I don't. That's how you like them apples. Um... Hit it! Before... No... I need to do it again to kill all these guys, though, but I don't want to waste this. Um. Um. Ah, I'm freaking out. 
Let's buy that. I'm not freaking out anymore. We're fine. And then that gets passed. He dies. Woo! Oh, what's this one? Oh yeah, when you acquire a tile, take two damage. Enemies adjacent to it also take two damage. And then when it gets to the bottom, it shuffles back. I mean, that's fine, I guess. I'll buy that. Like, ow, it hurt us, but it zapped him. So let's, you know. Kill that guy. Sell that. Sweet relief. Go back to our easy fights. Yeah, the, like, the, like weeding out potential clients who don't think being an Electromancer is funny. Like, there's something to be said about, like, working with the right people. I mean, and even, so long as you're not doing something, like, super terrible, like, getting people to be, like, that have a sense of humor is going to be worth, uh, more than, the, you know, one or two extra people who are not really worth your time. Yeah, let's reduce the cost of those tiles. <sighs> Execute a junk golem. Don't mind if I do. And that will cycle back in because that's how that works. I mean, this will only affect the light. Yeah, fuck. keepers. That does keep us. What's this? The weapon's damage increased for each deck of burn. How much damage does it do? Be expensive. Well, bah, bah, bah. Bah, bah, bah. I think it's time. There's enough people on the board. Let's just use this now. Blomp. Also, we have that. So, blomp. Also, we have this. So, oh, yes. now here's again the, one of the nice things is the, the wording on you have to be attentive to wording. Shuffle two exact copies of target ability into the deck. Hidden Blades, because we reduced its price, is free. So, it's not just copying two things of Hidden Blades in the deck, it's copying two things of a free Hidden Blades into the deck. Yeah, we use it. I was thinking, like, I could save it and then, like, use the magic lamps to keep powering it, send more and more and more. But I think I'd rather use the magic lamps on the Tomb of Element. Tomb of Element? Well, they'll be their tomb, huh? No, I just misspoke. The Tome of Elemental Magic. Uh, you die. And... I mean, well, I kind of want the boss to show up so I can... Yeah. Your lucky day. Send those in. Where? The problem is I keep getting like, I want this, but I want it with the tome. I want this, but I want it with incinerate. I can't just have all my stuff at once. To your help. And... Ow. Sure, buy that, whatever. Send it back. I don't want it. Yes, thank you. Uh, I don't have to that jar. You. I need this. Womp. Hit it. All those work out. That'll do two damage total, because I'm doing it by one. Yeah, it's fine. It's gonna hurt, but it's fine. All right, all other enemies are taken care of. Finally. That will be needed. Buy this. We buy this. And now we just can... Copy... You can copy a... You can seek a wishing lamp? That Heck yes. Needed. And now we... Uh, don't fix that. Ah, what the... Sweet relief. Okay, well, that wishing lamp was a waste, but... <laughs> Seek! Another wishing lamp! Like, please stop breaking the game! No, I refuse. 
Uh, yeah. More tiles. All the tiles. A new toy. Uh, and then we fix this some more. And then we copy a wishing lamp and fix it some more. More time. See, why couldn't I get this when I was doing the actual daily quest? Like, I'm sorry. Did you want your game to go absolutely bonk? He's gone mad with. Pa he has gone mad with power. Like, depending on my luck, I could do this. Okay, I don't have that much luck, though. Uh, none of those are actually super useful. Whatever. Do a damage, sure. Do that first, and then... No, because if I keep getting Seek, I can just keep getting Lamps and keep doing it over and over. It's... But I did. I, I ran out. I cannot do it infinitely. Oh, now I get a Seek. Well, Hidden Blades. And might as well fix all that now. Hidden Blades. Uh, I think everything is free at this point anyways. So we'll just get a heal. And finally... Yeah. And now the fun begins. More. More. Or Okay, now I'm kind of dying, so let's do that. Hi! Well, we can buy this to get more stuff. And buy this to get more stuff. See, so yeah, I went from, what, like, three extra cards to 24? Ugh. Away with you. Of course, now here's the problem. I have to hope that she comes up before I run out of cards, like selling them all. Oh, here she comes. That's fine. Don't worry about it. Don't worry about it. We're still we're still going bonkers crazy. Okay, stab and stab and a little bit of stab. Stab. Oh, we keep getting those. So it keeps Filling us stuff back up. I approve. Stab and stab. Lucky day. And more of those. What does she even do for an attack? Maybe I should open the menu at some point just to see what her attack is. Also, how does she get six attack and then four? Like, I don't get a six attack base. Um, so she'll do four to herself. So once she's down to seven, we're good. So like now. Oh, we'll buy that so that we get more. Wait, how does it say it's 12 cards? Away with you. Get one extra from this. Okay, so yeah, that was that just kept the oh well. And now she dies. And we just roll in the gems like Scrooge McDuck in his bank full of gold coins. A cause for celebration. Nothing like unused tile bonus, 120. Oh, look at that. Hidden blades and wishing lamp. I'm sorry, was the game not broken enough for you? So yeah, that's why she's kind of fun. It's basically you get all the crazy card copying abilities of uh, mischief with a bit of the card copying and creation abilities of uh, Greybeard. It is bonkers, and I love it. Radioactive. Anything useful here? Yeah, actually. And we'll do that for hitting heavy if we need to. Onwards. There's no cure. I didn't see the rest. Like it's probably like there's no cure for Swampalina's like toxic. 
potions or whatever, but I just, there's no cure for Swampalina. Isn't that the, there's no cure for Swampalina. Uh, we just gotta get lucky. We got lucky. Okay, then we... Oh, I need one more gold, and then I can use Incinerate on him. Hmm. Okay, that's fine. We can do this. It will we'll take a lot of damage between the poison and this, but... It works out. We heal a bit from Vampire, so it's okay. Oh no, but I can't buy this. Wait, mm, okay. Well, Forrester that. That's not how I wanted to do this, but... All right. You're on fire. And I was like, what? You hurt him already. Why don't you execute? Yeah, because he's still on fire. I can get the gold for this and do it again. That'll kill him off. And then I can save Execute when I don't have this really nice setup of double incinerate. Uh, health Vial, which we... That'll help a lot in Swamp Because then it's like, oh no, poison when I come in, and he's poisoning, and... Everyone's poisoning. But then I can just heal. So it's okay. Don't care about the dagger. Oh no, the guy came in and poisoned me. And he's about to poison me again. I have healing items. Now we buy this. Kill him. Because this... So the problem is all these guys are in stealth, so I can't target them. This will do damage to everyone, whether or not they're in stealth. It doesn't matter. I think what I do first, I just take a massive hit. We'll kill him. Get that. Get gold. We don't care about that. So let's get money for it. Now we play the get lucky game. That's, I mean, yeah, that's good. I'm really hoping for Seek so that I could copy Lightning Storm. That would actually, like, as much as I like the, like, ooh, you know, 80 copies of Hidden Blades, ooh, Lightning Storm would actually be more useful right here. toy. And we hit him. Hey, all right. It's like, we hit him, oh no. We're nearly dead, but it's okay. We vampired some health back. Oh no, he comes in, he poisons us. Poisons us again. We fix it. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. And then I have enough health to take another massive beating from this guy. Here's what I think I do. We get that a hole. Let's shuffle everybody back in. Wicked witch, Swampalina. The wicked witch Swampalina. Your lucky day. So wicked, much witch. Wow. Well, if I knew there was another junk golem, I wouldn't have used that execute. So let's just start hurting him. Again with that helmet. Stop fixing the helmet. Like, stop oh, taking shoot. the helmet. Uh, I don't know, what do we get? Random, random, random. Okay. This, this is good, this is good, this is good. Witch's room, again, like I talked about before. Two exact copies. So we'll get this, which lowers the cost of abilities. Now we copy two exact copies of a free thing of Light Storm. Honestly, I kind of want, like, yeah, powering up the, uh, 
book really good. But having more of this? Not bad either. A new toy. You know, let's just use up this book in case we get things to seek. You know, Eviscerate actually will serve us pretty well now. Uh. Nah. So we're not going to have as many going mad with power things, but we're going to have a lot of these. So there's enemies. Not anymore. There are no enemies. Enemies don't exist. They're all dead. They died in the light storm. And that, you know, makes sense. It, it, it's her flavor. She's the, the Electromancer. She's not the Stabomancer. I mean, she kind of is, but, you know. Uh, actually, let's get this. 12 damage to you, lady. And let's do it again. 12 damage to you, lady. <gasps> A free thing of Lightning Storm? Don't mind if I do. Uh, sure, just whatever generates more cards. And because we have this, this shuffle thing in with us, it's like, oh no, how long will it take before enemies appear? Is it right now? Invigorating, no? Close. That will be needed. Stab him. Anguish. Oh, hey, look at that. More free copies of things. Let's shuffle that in. And... Yeah, another lightning storm. Why not? Play right away. That, what? Don't delay, play right away. But I'm literally playing the game. You couldn't tell me to play the game if I wasn't off. Croom it, my man. You. I have some questions. And a dupe. And a dupe. And a dupe. I don't need an execute. Like, I've got plenty of stuff, but just because we can, let's take execute. There's two enemies left, and whichever one I find is just gonna be like, oh dang. No, thank you. There's a bad guy. Oh, isn't that cute? He's like, I hit, I hit him really high. Oh, you're dead. Sure. Look at that. We made some stuff free because because I don't know what I'm doing at this point. I'm getting revenge for my daily going poorly, I guess. Oh, guys. Guys, it's a junk golem. What am I gonna do? Oh, here's the other thing that's fun. Eviscerate. And then you're like, okay, stab. Stab, stab. Stab, stab. Eviscerate. Oh, yes. <laughs> Scrap him. That's the plan. Uh, and you die? And... Oh, yes. Don't suppose I can get any, as a seeing, uh, yeah, I was gonna say, because if I got another, like, hidden blades or a lightning, then I could cycle in, get some more. Hit it. I don't even need to hit him. He'll kill himself, but. Electromancer Ich Ichida strikes again. Okay, thank you. It's, I hope you have more monologuing, because we're not done counting up all your excessive amounts of violence. We are on the uh, Uber Lich. We maybe couldn't get there in the the daily, but we'll get him this time. Maybe this is a not great start. Who can I actually fight? No, 
Don't get me killed instant. That guy. That costs six. Ugh. Won't be needing that. I do need that, but I think I have to do that. Like, I'll take damage from this guy because the Coco Cat's in the same row. But I think I just have to try and get lucky. Okay. More chances to try and get lucky. Okay, we can copy another book. That'll help. Just reshuffle all of this business. Uh, let's do that. Get another book. All right, there we go. We're we're making some progress so that we might not die instantly. Or piercing dam- like, yeah, I could do 10 damage if someone's on fire, but I don't have- well, alright. Like, do I injure- no, there we go. I'm just gonna kill that guy, that's one less dude to worry about. There we go. We needed that. No. Will you triumph? Won't wait. No, okay, this'll be fine. I was like, won't the poison kill me? No, because I'm doing this. Okay. Decisive. Yes. Let's buy that. Use that. All right, so he's dead. The other dude shuffle. Okay. Okay. Things are starting to get to get online. Alright, execute, sure. Get rid of this guy. It's like, the problem is, okay, I've got this good setup for, like, copying and using this and stuff, but I've got these two teleports in, which kind of hinder my... Like, so you either have to get rid of a teleport, which I could do, or I use them and then try and get this lit... I don't know. Oh, and we still have the Forester, so I guess let's do that now. Buy this, let's shuffle that in. Uh, Poison that. What am I doing? No, all right, cycle, okay. We're set up, we've got this for when something, when that appears. Finders keepers. That works. That works well, actually. Okay. Thanks, poison. Oh, yes. Now we. Well, that's fortunate. Okay. I was really hoping for a copy of C. Not lying, because copying a lightning storm or meditate, actually, that. Lower the cost of all that. Finders keepers. Blah. Okay, poison. We'll take care of that guy. Finders keepers. Do that. All right. That's him taking care. A new toy. Come on, man. Give me it. I mean, that's not bad. It's just. Feeling good. I really could use these spells. There. Thank you, Seek. Yes. That will be needed. Won't be needing that. And then, Wapow! And that guy, he's got no help. Wapow! Uh, let's get rid of that. Got space for this, so one, two, three. Oh, one, two, three. Oh, no, 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 no. Three. Uh, hidden blades. Yes, yes, yes. Thank you. Mm. 
<laughs> Fortuitous. You. Because now I can kill him outright. Oh, I had four damage? Wow. I didn't know I was doing four base damage. I'm not sure how that worked. Oh, plus one from the poison and then Judicator. Okay. Never mind. I see how that works. A new toy. All of you, die, please. Uh... I guess let's just take care of this guy manually. For your help. Ow. Like I should have a broom in here, right? And then I can copy these. So I don't really want to. Mm. Well, that guy dies from the poison. <laughs> Now, oh, here comes another one of those folk. And the craziness begins again. Copying the magic lamps. Now, whatever, we'll do that for damage. That's fine. And then we can just copy over it to something. Like that. Sure. I don't know. I think we're going to do this one. I don't think it really matters what I pick at this point. We got enough crazy powerful stuff going on. Hey, look at that. More magic lamps. Yeah, it's beginning again. Here we go. Uh, which one of the... We'll go for the more cards route. And we'll do the that route. <laughs> You're like, why do you waste the thing? So what I'm going to do is then buy this one. What? And then I get more uses, so maybe I'll find another thing of Seek and can copy the lamp. Crush them. <laughs> you know, it, it's a long shot, but if I could just, you know, break the game even more, why not? Eh, no think just more and more eviscerates. Because apparently eviscerating someone once wasn't enough. What luck. And look, using hidden blades gives us more eviscerate. Uh, you'll oh, die. Luck. Actually, you'll die. Uh, execute does not help. So let's use meditate. That'll be cheaper. And finally. Because here's the thing. One of the benefits with Eviscerate and Stab is because you get two copies per thing, and then you can Eviscerate again. And that's like one thing a Stab gets you, two more uses. And then you Eviscerate again. Ah, good time. For me, not for him. Um, okay, sure. Let's just, you're dead. We're done with this. Like, I could keep going, but you're dead. We're, get out of here. And that concludes our tale of how Ichita broke the game wide open, and everyone was happier for it. 
but I think I'll take the Tome of Element. I like that it's also the Tome of Elemental Magic. Apparently, like, shanking someone with a knife is elemental magic. Abracadabra stab. 